Welcome you all to Krishnavik channel. Our today's project through a Linux shell script, currency converter. This script converts currency using an external API. It prompts the user for the amount, source currency, and target currency and then displays the converted amount. API stands for Application Programming Interface. It is a set of rules, protocols, and tools that allows different software applications to communicate with each other. APIs define the methods and data formats that applications can use to request and exchange information. They play a crucial role in enabling the integration of different software systems and services, allowing them to work together and share data seamlessly. APIs are used extensively in software development for building, extending, and connecting applications and services. To get an API key for a currency conversion service, you typically need to follow these steps. 1. Choose a currency conversion provider. First, decide which currency conversion provider you want to use. Some popular options include Exchange Rate API, Open Exchange Rates, XE.com, etc. Visit the provider's website. 2. Sign up for an account on the provider's website. Look for a Sign Up or Get Started button. Click it to create an account. You'll likely need to provide your email address and create a password. 3. Verify your email if required. Some providers may require you to verify your email address by clicking a link sent to your email inbox. Check your email and follow the verification instructions. 4. Log in to your account. Once your account is set up and verified, sign in to your account using the credentials you provided during registration. 5. Navigate to API access or dashboard within your account. Look for a section related to API access or a dashboard where you can manage your API keys. The exact location and wording may vary depending on the provider. 6. Generate a new API key in the API access or dashboard section. You should find an option to generate a new API key. Click on it. The provider may ask you to choose a plan free or paid and agree to their terms of service. 7. Access your API key. After generating the API key, it should be displayed on your screen. It's typically a long string of letters and numbers. This key is essential for making API requests. 8. Store your API key securely. API keys are sensitive credentials. Store your API key securely and never share it publicly. In production applications, consider using environment variables or a secure configuration file to store your API keys. 9. Use the API key in your script. Replace your underscore API underscore key in your script with the actual API key you obtain from the provider. 10. Test your script. Run your script to ensure it can successfully make API requests using your API key. This is a very valuable script for students. Hope you will enjoy it. Happy learning. Let's start. Choose a location to write the script. I choose my underscore data directory, as always. Type the following command to create a script file named currency underscore converter dot sh. Type your sudo user's password. Press I or insert key and write the following script. This script has six parts. Part 1, to prompt respectively for input amount, source currency and target currency. Part 2, in this segment you have to create and put API key. Part 3, through this segment we will use an URL of a particular currency conversion provider to execute the conversion. For this exercise, we'll use the Exchange Rate API. Part 4, to check the online connectivity with the website link of API provider. Part 5, to calculating the conversion from source currency to target currency. Part 6, to display the converted currency amount as final result. Let's create an API key. Copy this following URL of Exchange Rate, you have to sign up and get your API key from their website.
If you want to use other currency conversion providers like Open Exchange Rates or another similar service, then you must change this URL with their URL. Paste the URL on the Google search, click on the first link. Now, to get your API key, type your email ID and click on the Get Free Key button. Create a password for your account ID for this site. Click on the Accept Terms and Create API Key button. Solve this puzzle to prove you are not a robot. Finally, you got your API key. Select and copy the API key. Now, paste the API key between double inverted commas. OK, script editing has completed. Save and exit. Assign execute permissions for all users to the script file. Let's check. OK, the file is now executable for all users. Let's run the script. Enter any amount what you want to convert, like 100. Type the code of source currency, such as INR for Indian Rupee. Now, type the code of target currency, such as BDT for Bangladeshi Taka. And done. This is the BDT converted amount of 100 Indian Rupees at present. Let's see some other examples, such as Euro to SAR the Saudi Rial. Done. Or US dollar to Euro. Done. Remember that the process of obtaining an API key can vary between providers. So be sure to refer to the specific documentation or instructions provided by the provider you choose. Additionally, some providers may have usage limits on their free plans, so be aware of any rate limits or restrictions associated with your API key. Let's know for whom this currency converter script is most essential. A currency converter script can be essential and valuable for various individuals and groups, including number one, travelers. Travelers often need to convert currency when visiting different countries. A currency converter script can help them quickly determine the equivalent value of their money in the local currency. Number two, businesses. Businesses that engage in international trade or have customers and suppliers in different countries need to perform regularly currency conversions. This script can be integrated into financial systems or used for manual conversions. Number 3. Online shoppers. People who shop online from international websites may want to convert prices from one currency to another to understand the cost better. Number 4. Investors. Currency conversion is crucial for investors in the foreign exchange forex market or for those with international investments. They need to monitor currency exchange rates and calculate potential gains or losses. Number 5. Freelancers and remote workers. Freelancers and remote workers who receive payments in different currencies may use this script to convert earnings to their preferred currency for accounting and financial planning. Number 6. Students and researchers. Students and researchers in economics, finance, or international business may find this script useful for academic purposes and data analysis. Number 7. Developers. Developers working on applications or websites that involve currency conversion features can use this script as a foundation for building more advanced currency conversion functionality. Number 8. Small businesses. Small businesses that operate internationally but may not have access to sophisticated financial software can use this script for basic currency conversion needs. Number 9. Anyone interested in currency markets. Individuals interested in tracking currency markets and exchange rates for personal or educational purposes can use this script to check currency values. In summary, the currency converter script is a versatile tool that can be useful for a wide range of people and organizations, from travelers and online shoppers to businesses and financial professionals.
Its utility lies in its ability to quickly and accurately convert between different currencies, which is a common need in our increasingly interconnected global economy. Thanks for watching. Get ready to be thrilled because another exciting video is just coming your way in just one week. Stay with us.